Welcome in, Greg Ruff and Chad Hibden, the women's basketball coach here at Trevecca. And last night, uh, what I would say, a good game against Tiffin. You went in there uh, outmanned with some hurdles. Yeah. And I thought your team played really well. I don't know that you agree with that, but. I thought we played hard. Yeah. Uh, I, I, you know, we got off to a slow start. And, and just there's mm -hmm. been those um, spots in, in these last few games that uh, we've come up on the short end. Uh, especially uh, Alabama Huntsville, Auburn Montgomery, and then tonight or last night, and um, it's it just consistency, and that's what we're trying to get them to to see and understand, and then obviously produce. And so I was, I was, I was proud of the effort, proud of the the fight. There's so many things that we didn't do well, uh, but that's what happens. Uh, we were without uh, you know another. Uh, starter uh, that would have been three off the mm -hmm. court last night and uh, I like the fact that you know these the next you know player up is is taking the opportunity and they're, they're competing and fighting and uh, you know we're, we're a little bit um, undermanned right now but we're not using that obviously as excuses and we had we had a chance to win that basketball game and there's just some things that we've got to get better and we better do it quick because Ohio Dominican is is a really good basketball team they'll be one of the top teams I think in the league and then the next couple games after that for conference play are uh, two of the best teams you know yeah. Cedarville and Wesleyan so um, no rest for the weary uh, and uh, nobody's uh, sim giving us any sympathy and so that's what we have to understand. We've got to understand the competitive nature of this conference and in uh, college basketball and, uh, and just improve. Uh, in particular, you talked about this, and, and I'll bring it up. Uh, sometimes you've had trouble getting started in a game, offensively in particular. Are, are there things that you can do to, to remedy that? Yeah, I mean, it's just it's having a better understanding of what we're trying to do from the get-go and getting our uh, players to, to execute that. And I think we've just got to be more uh, precise and productive at that. And the way we do that is just, you know, focus on the details and go out and have confidence in, in what we've prepared to do and uh, go let that, you know, let that carry over to the game. I've been impressed uh, by several of your freshmen, uh, their contributions. I think Wilkes on uh, night before last against Tiffin, really showed some things. You took some contact, scored, and, and things like that. That's the, those are the differences that you see a freshman maybe turning the corner and really helping you down the stretch, right? Yeah, Caitlin's going to be a great player yeah. here. We, and I told her that yesterday. I said it, it's going to take a little bit of time, you know, for her to just get comfortable with the speed and the physicality of the game at the college level. And she's a freshman. She's playing against – girls, you know, two or three, four years older than her in some cases. And uh, uh, and so it's just an adjustment. Every one of our freshmen, um, you know, have given us something and yeah. what we thought we could get out of them. Mm -hmm. And that's what we're holding them accountable to is, is that level of play. And now they're just trying to figure out how to be consistent with that. And so we're, we're pleased. We're, we're, you know, and Annalise is, is basically yep. like a redshirt freshman. Yes. Uh, new to the program and uh, didn't get a lot of minutes last year, uh, you know, over at Tennessee State and uh, doing a lot of great things. So, you know, when we see her play, she's, she's, she's figuring it out too. Mm -hmm. yeah. Absolutely. Ohio Dominican, last word, just because they they lost at Kentucky Western. Kentucky Western's a pretty good basketball team, it looks yeah. like. Uh, we got to see them here, but talk about Ohio Dominican and what you how you're going to attack them uh, this afternoon. I mean, we, we, we have to space them. We have to keep them from uh, just – you know, making the court small uh, because they're long and they're athletic and they're gritty and they like to turn you over and they like to get after you. They like to be physical. Mm -hmm. And so we've got to spread the floor offensively and defensively, and make them, uh, you know, have to work. Uh, and, and, and ball reversals on offense and just moving and passing and cutting is going to be really, really important. And then defensively, we're just going to have to have a tougher mindset. We didn't guard the ball very well last night, and that hurt us on, on their guards getting to the rim. And so, and, uh, you know, Ohio Dominican is similar. So we've just got to improve uh, from from the last performance. He's Chad Hibden, and we've got the start of tonight's game right after this.